It is easy to customize your inspection reports on the fly. This is useful if you encounter unusual conditions on your inspections or find the inspection templates you're using don't handle conditions you commonly encounter. Some of the tools you use for customizing your inspection are found under the Add Copy button on your toolbar. From this menu, you might add a heading below the current heading, add a subheading below the current heading, add a schematic below the current heading, which could be used for drawings, or copy the current heading or subheading to replicate an area to accommodate a new item, such as an extra room, or when a component is repeated, or even add an entire form to your inspection. Similar options are available in the mobile apps that let you copy headings or subheadings to replicate sections. Some editions do not have all of the options available. The Premier Edition, of course, has everything that is available. There are also buttons positioned under your list of narratives to allow you to add or modify these items. Let's see a brief example of how you might add new items while inspecting a roof. The first thing we're going to demonstrate is changing the subheading label. Let's change our label style to type. We tap on the label and our modify subheading options become available. Let's change this to type. Notice there is a checkbox called Modify in Master Forms. If you wish the change that you are making to be changed for future inspections, check this off. In this case, we're only going to change it for this inspection, so we'll simply click OK. Notice the label has now been updated in our existing report. We now want to add a means of roof access to the inspection, and notice there's no subheading for this. We can click the Add Copy option and choose to add a subheading. We now type in the name of the subheading that we wish to add. We can select to modify in our master forms if this is something we want to use in the future and click OK. Notice our new Roof Access subheading has been added to our report. We may now inspect our Roof Access. Let's say while inspecting we've entered a new comment, such as this one, viewed from roof edge on ladder. As we type the comment, we realize this is common text that we wish to use in future inspections as well. We may simply highlight the text that we have entered, and then go and click Add for our narratives. We now need to specify an abbreviation. The abbreviation is a short reminder of what the full text contains, thus saving you time as you quickly go through your inspection. We're going to call this From Ladder. We can make any additional change to the text at this point for our future forms. When done, we may click OK to add the item. Notice the new item appears in the Narratives menu. When we exit the program later, we'll be prompted to compile changes that we've made to our master forms for the future. Thus, in the future, we can simply tap the item to add the full text to our inspections. Some of the other options are also demonstrated in other videos, but you get the idea. It's easy to use the available options to customize an inspection report for a single job or to modify it for additional inspections you do later.